Sly Guy TV, and you're watching the Sly Guy, the Sly Guy, the Sly Guy. Kaboom! So wake me up, cause I'm a speedy man. I can't believe what my eyes are seeing. Now wake me up, I can't find a meaning. Nothing really matters when the world is sinking down, down, down. Welcome back, guys, to another episode of Sly Guy TV. And now, I have modified the Delops Awakening deck. Removing blue, making it pri primarily light and shadow or white and black with more mana ramps, more mana dorks, more mana acceleration so that we can eventually get to a Talir and go off and it has gone off real fast in practice. So hopefully it goes off real fast now and doesn't let us down anymore. Okay, there we go. Let's uh, start. I have two mana acceleration here. Hopefully we get our Talir. Talira. Ooh. And latest news in Magic the Evering. Secret Lair Walking Dead is out. And believe it or not, it's legal. It's not a silver bordered car set. It's legal in Commander. It's legal in all Legacy, in Legacy, Modern, like all Eternal formats. I mean... Wow, weird. <laughs> You're gonna have uh, Rick Grimes. Okay, let's start getting. Nah. Okay, next turn. You're gonna have Rick Grimes, Negan. You're gonna have the Governor, Michonne, Daryl. And they're gonna be magic in magic lore. It's not like wizards or zombies, like a different version of Liliana. It's actually the actual characters of The Walking Dead. And um, it's only available for one week, which made a lot of people very angry. So a lot of people are very angry at wizards right now for uh, only uh, making it available for that time period. Meaning uh, a lot of people won't get their hands on those cards, which will lead to a lot of angry, angry, angry players so burden time let's play the burden there we go <clears throat> and we're going to be playing ganache because ganache will uh, help us wipe out the rest of their army okay we're gonna have to play a bit defensively now how that guy Play that with the daring reform. Yes. Hmm. And kill that daring reform. And we're gonna have to replay the apprentice mage. With our Badan. Let's hope he doesn't kill me till then. <laughs> yeah, he's gonna attack with the 5 3. But I'll be down to 9. Okay, taking a while. Oh, so the spell shaper. And he's gonna bounce that thing back into my hand. Well, gonna have to block. That is weird. 12 elimination spells, and not one of them showed up. Hmm. Well, next game. Let's do three games, so at least we'll be able to uh, make sure we draw all the key cards. Alright, game number two. For the Lumen Reclaimer deck, so we're going to test it thoroughly. 
to make sure it goes off. Just fix the mana, fix the creatures. Okay, there we go. Let's give it a try now. Alright. Right, this is Trailmaker, Trailblazer. Okay, there we go. Oh, Aspire Champion. Let's put that there. Yeah, let's desecrate that thing. Okay. Then we'll have the World Bear Behemoth real soon. Ooh, a uh, shifted Sulta Loyalist right there. World Bearer is right there. Okay. All we have to do is draw Talir and we're going to be good. Boom! You didn't even let me pull my combo off yet. And I wasn't able to play the Delops Awakening. Away, first day of the win, first day of the win, yes. So let's go with our third game. Oh, silver chest, nice. There we go. That look gun slinger. Slinger the shingla. With the Ruben Ruben Reclaimer. Nice. Okay, still searching for an opponent, and we'll be uh, playing the third game. We're one on one, and right now we need to get a third win for this deck to graduate. There we go. <laughs> So what, is he going to concede too? <clears throat> Yo, hurry up. And this guy plays as slow as the players on Arena. Everyone in Arena maxes out their timers all of them are really slow i mean you could literally go outside make yourself a sandwich and when you're back the guy's still thinking and he's really just about ready to be uh timed out yeah we're gonna need some land okay there we go we have to thin out the deck get some land Eliminate everything. Yeah, one more land, then I can get a burden, and then I can use that burden to draw more cards. And hopefully draw into a Talir. And a Merchant. Yup, what's that? Sell that Cult Aspirant. The Cult Aspirant. <coughs> Oh, it's an aspirin. Take that, aspirin. Okay, Lumen Reclaimer. Shuffle everything back. Into the deck attack. Mm -hmm. Okay, there. Thank you. That's exactly what I wanted. Now I will make multiple copies of the Reclaimer in the deck. Oh yes. There we are. Really nice. Let's uh, revive the Reclaimer. Okay. Memory Bridger. Let's 
put back the reclaimer. Shuffle everything. Shuffle in the grave. Now we can get ourselves a burden. Grow dogs, but damn. Yes. And he's banishing it. Oh, thank you. You're just um, making my deck bigger. And I'll be able to uh, burden out more reclaimers. Here comes the burden. Burden. Yes. Oh, it's Vera. Vera, Vera. Very nasty. Play the weapon on one of my units. Hopefully I get so I draw some elimination. I mean I put in a lot of elimination here and none of it is showing up. Yeah, let's take that. Oh, there's Talir. Come on. Okay, almost there. Just a bit more. Oh my, not enough land. Why, why, why? Oh well. Yeah, oh well. <laughs> so still not graduating. Too bad. Just fell short. Because it ran out of land. So we're really going to need some ramp for this deck. Well, we'll take a break from uh, the Delps Awakening first. And uh, tomorrow we're going to be revisiting one of the over decks that we have. And uh, yeah, you know what? Let's open a path. Legendary, please. Boom. Nope, not a legendary, but a vengeful flight. Hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. Once again, this is for Sly Guy TV with the Sly Guy, Sly Guy, and Sly Guy signing off right now.